Hi everyone, welcome to the Defense Support Channel. Please comment below if you have something to add. Like the video and don't forget to subscribe to this channel. The MiG-1.44 is a Russian fighter jet prototype developed in the 1990s as a next-generation air superiority fighter for the Russian Air Force. The nickname Flatpak refers to its modular construction, which allows for easy assembly and disassembly. The MiG-1.44 was designed to be highly maneuverable and to have a top speed of Mach 2.3, around 2,800 kilometers slash 8 or 1,700 miles per hour at high altitude. It was also intended to have a low radar signature, making it difficult for enemy radar systems to detect. However, due to a lack of funding and the collapse of the Soviet Union, the MiG-1.44 program was cancelled in the mid-1990s and only one prototype was ever built. Some of its technology and design features were later incorporated into the Sukhoi Su-57, which is currently in service with the Russian Air Force. The MiG-1.44 was designed to have a delta wing configuration with a canard foreplane and a single engine. It featured advanced avionics, including a digital fly-by-wire control system and a glass cockpit with multifunction displays. The prototype of the MiG-1.44 made its first flight in February 2000, and several test flights were conducted in the following years to evaluate its performance. The aircraft was generally well received by test pilots, who praised its handling and maneuverability. However, the Russian government ultimately decided not to put the MiG-1.44 into production, citing concerns over its cost and the availability of funding for other military programs. Instead, the government chose to focus on developing the Sukhoi Su-57, which is also a fifth-generation fighter jet. Although the MiG-1.44 program was cancelled, it represented an important step forward for Russian aviation technology. Many of its design features and technologies were later incorporated into other aircraft, including the Su-57 and the MiG-35. The MiG-1.44 was designed to be highly maneuverable, with a high thrust-to-weight ratio and a powerful engine. It was intended to be capable of performing a range of missions, including air-to-air -air combat, ground attack, and reconnaissance. One of the key features of the MiG-1.44 was its low radar signature, which was achieved through a combination of design features and advanced materials. The aircraft had a blended wing body design, with no sharp edges or corners that could reflect radar signals. It also incorporated radar-absorbing materials and coatings to further reduce its radar signature. In addition to its advanced avionics and stealth features, the MiG-1.44 was also designed to be highly modular and easy to maintain. Its modular construction allowed for easy replacement of damaged or worn-out components, which could be quickly swapped out in the field without requiring extensive maintenance. Although the MiG-1.44 never entered production, its legacy can be seen in the development of other Russian fighter jets. The Sukhoi Su-57, which entered service in 2020, incorporates many of the same design features and technologies as the MiG-1.44. The MiG-35, a multi-role fighter jet that is currently in development, also draws heavily on the technology and design of the MiG-1.44. The MiG-1.44 was developed in response to the need for a next-generation fighter jet to replace the aging fleet of Soviet-era fighter aircraft. It was designed to have a high degree of agility and maneuverability, as well as advanced avionics and weapon systems. The aircraft was powered by a single Saturn 117S engine, which was capable of generating up to 33,000 pounds of thrust. This gave the MiG-1.44 a top speed of around Mach 2.3 and a range of up to 3,500 kilometers, around 2,200 miles, with external fuel tanks. The MiG-1.44 was armed with a range of air-to-air -air and air-to-ground weapons, including a 30mm cannon, air-to-air -air missiles, and precision-guided bombs. It was also equipped with advanced radar and targeting systems, as well as a helmet-mounted display system that allowed the pilot to aim weapons simply by looking at their target. Despite its advanced design and capabilities, the MiG-1.44 ultimately proved too expensive for the Russian government to put into production. However, its legacy can be seen in the development of other Russian fighter jets, which have incorporated many of the same design features and technologies.